Ladies and gentlemen, this video is being recorded in February of 2024, and it seems like every other week at this point, news comes out about AI that will potentially put millions of people out of a job and absolutely set on fire and burn to the ground many multi-billion and potentially trillion dollar industries. But there is a haven where AI does not threaten our existence. And that haven is chess. In the chess world, we have embraced our AI overlords for quite some time. And in today's video, I will be playing an AI. And not just any AI. I will be playing my AI clone on chess.com. You can play it, by the way, also 100% free. I'll put a link in the description in case you're interested. I made a video about this a long time ago, but that was version one. And I've been told by chess.com staff, they have improved my bot. It has now copied my playing style more accurately, and it even plays my openings. So now I'm not just playing a robot with a face. I'm really going to play my AI clone. Before we jump into the games today, I'd like to thank the sponsor of today's video, BetterHelp. Folks, I know it's February already, but your New Year's resolutions still matter. So why don't we work on ourselves and set some goals? Also, my voice is kind of dead right now. Please bear with me. Some goals are concrete and actionable, like learning a new opening, doing more chess puzzles, or finally hitting 500 rapid ELO. But some goals can relate to feelings and emotions, like being less angry around conflict or tackling some of our anxieties. Well, this may surprise you, but therapy can actually help you achieve what goal you'd like to. And therapy does this by creating SMART goals. And I know you're very smart. SMART stands for specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, and time-bound. And speaking of therapy, BetterHelp makes starting therapy much less intimidating for many people. You can meet with your therapist by phone call, video chat, or simple messaging. One-on-one -on -one physical meetings are not necessary. You simply fill out a questionnaire, and in most cases, you'll be matched with one of BetterHelp's 30,000 therapists in just 48 hours. And if you feel like your therapist isn't a good fit, you can switch therapists with just the click of a button at no additional cost to you. Over 4 million people have already started using BetterHelp to live a healthier, happier life. Let's make 2024 the year you start doing that too. All you gotta do is go to betterhelp.com forward slash Gotham Chess. The link is also available in the description and you'll get 10% off your first month of therapy. Now let's get back to the video. Thanks, sponsored Gotham. My friends, it is time for the rematch the entire world has been waiting for. Many, many moons ago, I played against the Gotham Chess Bot on chess.com when it first came out, and we fought to two draws. Back then, I was wearing a Galaxy Space hoodie, as you can see from the avatar. I sadly do not have that hoodie anymore, uh, but I'm wearing an uh, equally colorful one right now. And since this bot was launched in 2020, 2021, they have told me that they have made multiple improvements to it. It plays like me now. It plays my openings. So we will see. And we will see if they also improve my voice lines, because the last time that I played against this bot, it definitely did not talk like me. First game I will play with the black pieces. Here we go. Gotham Chess plays E4 and says, I have some time between streams. Let's get... Oh, that's what I said, like, years ago. I have some time between streams. Look, I've got the bot dialogue there. All right, this is very trippy. Gotham Chess versus Gotham Chess. Uh... I don't want to play. You know what? I've been playing Scandinavian recently, right? So I feel like I should play Scandinavian. I'm going to play Scandinavian against my bot. Oh, you have a threat. No, dummy. It's move one. No, nobody has a... I guess it kind of has a threat. Uh, or whatever. And then he said, let's get this started. All right, we're playing Scandinavian. Queen takes d5. Let me lower the volume a little bit. I've, t I've had to turn it back up. Chess is hard. Oh yeah, they program my bot to just say chess is hard. That's all it says. And I don't even say that. I got beef with whoever decided, you know what, whatever. All right, so th this is actually what I play against the Scandinavian. That, that is my general uh, opening. So let's play bishop g4 now. Of course, I'm gonna play bishop e2 and knight c6. I'll probably castle or uh, play knight c3, yeah. And uh, this is a very aggressive system, so we're, we're, we're all castled up, probably knight c3, h3, okay. Kind of want to go for this. I, I kind of want to go for that, I, I, can't, I can't lie. Uh, maybe I will. Let's play h3, h5, we're getting real aggressive here. Oh, 
Now, in this position, queen f5 or queen d7 are, are both okay. Um, I'm thinking queen f5. And there's a line here, take, take. Yeah, so the computer is smart and, and doesn't, uh, doesn't lose immediately. There's a variation there where you can take, take, and then there's a massive attack uh, going toward the white position. Now, after d3, um, I mean, knight f6 looks good. e6 looks quite strong as well. e5 is always nice, but I kind of feel like I should go e6 to make sure that my king is never getting checked. So maybe I'll play e6. I'm going to try to attack my bot. Let's see. Will my bot perish under the pressure? Uh, bishop b3 is a logical move. I always want to sacrifice here. I'm not doing it right now because I don't have sufficient backup. You need two more attacking pieces than they have defenders, which is why I'm not rushing with that move. I really don't see anything wrong with bishop d6, just bringing the bishop out, targeting the king. Uh, yeah, my opponent plays knight e4. Opponent bot. Uh, the bot opponent. It's a good move, I think. Now I'm, you know, I'm, I'm starting to like worry that I've left my piece there a little bit too long and I should probably get a move on. But maybe not. Maybe it's, maybe it's okay. So how about knight f6 just to bring just another piece to the party? And okay, of course it's, it's going to trade. Oh, did I blunder? Why did my, is my bot insane? What is my bot doing? Take, yes. But, wait. My plan, so my plan when I played knight f6 was take, 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 knight is hanging. And then I put my queen over here, and if knight h2, I play queen e5, targeting the knight. And then if the knight takes, I have knight takes, and if bishop takes, I have mate. But if queen e5 and my opponent plays g3, I can go back to h5, threatening the knight, and then I win. So, is my bot stupid, or am I stupid? Other question is, do I take with the rook or the pawn? Because I like having backup on the h-file, but I also like having the pressure. So let's go here. Right now, I'm down a piece. Oh, there's knight g5! Uh-oh. Oh, I got too arrogant. Oh, my. I thought my bot was stupid. I mean, it is. It's me. But, you know, wait a minute. But maybe it's not over. Maybe it's not over. Hold on a second. I guess... Oh, maybe it is over. Oh, I might have messed this up real bad. All right, hold on. Queen e5 is still made here queen d5 f3 ah uh, queen e5 back bishop f4 queen check <laughs> help me <laughs> what is happening um I also just like this move, but I'm not sure it actually creates much of a threat on anything. But let's go here. I'm defending f7. I'm bringing another piece into the attack. Oh, if that move works, I'm cooked. Oh, man. If that works, I'm in trouble, boys and girls. I don't want to take on Passant. I definitely don't want to do that. All right, let's go knight d5. We're still trying here. Queen c1. I mean, listen, knowing me and knowing my bot... I'm going to do something dumb pretty soon. Like, we're, we're not far away from the something dumb happening in this game. All right? So, let's just, let's just relax. All right? I think I'm, I'm, I'm okay. All right. The bot is... Those are smart moves that it's making. It's making some good decisions. Um, it's trying to get rid of my pieces, and I'm trying to checkmate it. Maybe F6, but then I'm going to lose this knight. I can't lose this knight. I can't let the C file open. But I also don't think I can play a passive move. So maybe we play knight takes e3 and then play knight d4. And then we just kind of hope for the best in this position. But yeah, the bot has done a nice job here. Oh, the king is running. Oh, the bot is brave. Oh, the bot is way more brave than I could have ever been. Oh, I'm in trouble. And now it's going to put its knight right there. But again, I'm playing myself. Well, how would I beat myself? Fork? Check? How would I defeat myself in a game of chess? Huh? Fork. I guess there is this, though. Or that. But it's giving me, it's giving me the rook. 
Is it going to argue I'm not a good endgame player? Oh, it's not giving me the rook because after take, take, it's going to fork me again. Oh, boy. All right. I still think it's going to mess up. I mean, I know myself. And if this is me in AI form, I'm going to do something dumb. We are, we are not far from it happening. Let me throw in this check just to confuse my bot a little bit. You're just going to attack my king, no dinner first? I don't know why that's one of my voice lines. I've never said that sentence in my life. That, that is some, like, Gemini AI attempt at trying to, you know... He's too easy from here. Let's start a new game. Shut up, Gotham. God, no wonder people hate me. Uh, Rook B6, defending me. I'm just down a full piece. I mean, I'm not even... I'm not even putting up a fight anymore. Knight here. Can I maybe... I don't know. Check. I mean, I'm, I'm going for something. What? What? I just hung a knight. What? Why did I do that? Why did they make me so stupid? I would never play knight takes f7. I would find a different, unique way to lose this game, but knight takes f7? How stupid do they think I am? That's ridiculous. Now, white is still much better, but I told you it was just a matter of time, and now I'm, black is actually kind of back in the game. I'm defending myself. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm only down a pawn now, and I feel like there's more to come. Now, how do I survive? Rook f8, maybe? Rook f8, I gotta be careful. I can't lose my knight in the center of the board. Oh, all right, let's stretch out. Uh, G5 looks kind of creative to try to potentially lose, uh, lose that pawn to open up the G file. I might go for that. That doesn't, that doesn't look completely stupid. Maybe I'll play King B8. Just get the king off of any checking squares. That's a good move. All right. That, that also makes sense. Maybe now I sack the pawn. I really want to sack the pawn. I don't know for what. Like, I don't know why I'm trying to beat my bot a clean pawn down. Um, maybe I bring my rook. But again, I got to be careful about this move A3. Knight f5, take, take. The bot is going to try to trade queens with me. What do I do? Do I, do I attack and come back? Do I play g5? Do I play rook g8? What do I play? Um, there's a lot of possibilities here, and none of them look that bad. Let's just make sure we can't get back rank mated. How about that? When you don't know what to do, just make sure you're not getting back rank mated. My opponent also doesn't really know what to do. Stupid Gotham bot. Knight c2 targeting the rook. Rook is going to come up. We're going to make another draw against Gotham bot? That's so crazy. Am I actually going to draw this guy down a piece? Is that how bad my bot is? I mean, I'm bad. I lost the piece. This bot really is like me. <laughs> no way, right? Oh, oh, it doesn't repeat. Holy sh... Wow. Okay, wait a minute. No, we, we might be back in business. It's just, a, it's just a stamina competition with this guy. All right, knight f5. Wait a minute. I'm, I'm, I might win. I'm telling you all right now, I'm not, uh, I'm, I'm not going to mess around anymore. No more Mr. Nice Guy. I mean, I, I haven't been being nice to the bot at all, but all right, we're just doing a little knight rodeo here. Rook h7. Maybe I'm losing. I don't even know. I, I, I got so complacent with, with the position. I just thought, hopefully the bot blunders queen g6. Oh! I'm not even sure that's a blunder because bishop takes f5. Take, take, queen f5. All right, let's do this. Yeah, and now queen... Oh, is there rook g7? There might have been rook takes g7 there, but my bot is garbage, so he didn't see it. So I can go take, take, and we just go into a rook end game. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, another rook end game against Gotham bot. But I really want to win! I want to win, but I guess I can't win. I guess it's not possible. Maybe it is possible. Trust myself. I'm going for it. I'm, go I'm tired of drawing my own butt. What the f What is that? That's a horrible move. I'm just winning now, I think. What? Sh no way. I got to be winning. There's, there's no chance. Check, and, I, and I'm going to... Maybe I should have went there, but I don't know. Rook d3? Uh, how is this not winning? 
If I play Rook takes, is there like a back rank mate with Rook Queen F8? This is unbelievable. Rook D1, Queen E. I gotta have a win. I'm going for it. I don't trust my own bot. I'm going for it. No, 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 no. There's no way. Wait, it's just giving me a rook. Wait, my own bot is giving me a rook. What is this? That's a rook. I mean, it's going to take my rook, but then I'm going to play here and I'm going to win. What? Ah, I'm the best. I've defeated AI. Yes, rook d4. Now, I got to just make sure this is queen e1 check, and I can also play rook f4. But if I go here, I'm just getting to the back rank. Oh, my God, I'm winning. It's completely winning. You trash bot! Yes! Yes! I don't need my queen anymore. He is like me. He is like me. Oh my goodness, he's exactly like me. I'm gonna take all your pawns, you absolute clown. I'm gonna take the most important ones. Yeah, you think you're getting a promotion? You think, let me, let me, let me check you first, clown. Yeah! Now let me go here. Actually, I'll check you again. No, I'm not gonna check you again. I'm scared. King takes. It's over. I have no idea how I'll get back to this. In, 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 shut up! No, you won't. I got a queen and a pawn. You're dead. You're absolutely dead. You got nothing. Check, push pawn. Boom. You got no chance. Absolutely no chance. Now we win this game by bringing the king. Or just pushing. We just take away all of the squares. It's over. Now we play... We just, we just bring the king. I'm just going to bring the king. I'm going to bring the king right there. Watch this. Boom. 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 And I'm putting the king right there. And anywhere the rook moves, I, I, I got to win the rook now. Check. I have, to, I have to have something here that wins the rook. Check. King g2, queen d5. All right, the bot's trying to not lose the rook, but it will. And if it doesn't lose the rook, that's it. There we go. There we go. We're going to beat the bot. We're going to beat the bot. AI isn't as good as humans and chess. Just kidding. Just my bot. Just my bot. Oh, yes. Give me the checks. I'm going to make a rook, by the way. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Boom. Oh, yeah. Now we're just going to pre-move out the rest of the game. Oh, yes. All right. Check. And check. Let's just make sure we don't stalemate anybody. And now... even want to give this trash ass bot a rematch but i will i will i will oh yeah i gotta i gotta get a game with white i gotta see if he actually plays carl khan and i love how he has nothing to say we buried gotham chess's ego is what we did that's what we did oh yeah oh yeah all right 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 new game i don't want to be too arrogant i was dead lost in that game that was horrendous why did my bot just lose a night? Anyway. I have some time to play chess in between streams. It's, it's crazy. Can, 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 can... My bot doesn't even say danger levels or sacrifice the rook. Actually, I don't know if it says sacrifice the rook. All right. If it doesn't play Carl Khan, I'm quitting. Good man. Good man. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Now, do you think we can beat my bot with the alien gambit? I didn't want to play the alien gambit against my bot. I kind of wanted to say, like, if, if I have one chess game, one, and I'm playing E4, and aliens have a death beam pointed at planet Earth, in the words of Max Kellerman, I want Iguadala. Well, in my words, I love the carol. <laughs> This is such a pure and innocent voice line. It's like a five-year-old. I love the cow Khan. <laughs> I love a cow. By the way, just so you know, I learned the Carl Khan when I was like 19. I was a grown adult. Uh, I was not like a child. I played E4, you know, I played a lot of openings in my life, but Carl Khan was not one of them. Um, anyway, if I had one opening and my opponent, my aliens played the Carl Khan, I would probably play Advance or uh, f uh, Fantasy. But uh, I am very curious if, uh, if my bot can withstand the alien gambit. Again, it's a bot, so probably it will play perfectly, but let's see. Also, I play bishop f5 more than I play knight f6. So that might kind of be a buzzkill. Oh! Oh, yeah. Oh, that's it. Oh, GG. 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 
Alien Gambit against my bot. Incredible. I'm gonna cry. Uh-huh. Now we know Bishop D3 castles is the idea. Now let's see, how, how long will my bot play perfectly? What the f- <laughs> What is that? I've never seen that move in my life. Oh my god, and, and again, I'm playing a robot, so I have no idea. Did Gotham already make a mistake? Can I take? And then the only move is... Well, there's King G8. And then maybe there's Bishop C4. Knight D5. Queen D... Ah, uh, that looks... Oh my goodness. I mean, that looks terrible for black, but I don't want to... You know what I mean? I don't want to go all in, like, yet, because I, I don't want to... Oh, my goodness. This is so absurd. Take, take, take. King g8. A bishop c4, knight d5. I really don't have a winning move in that position, because if I bring my queen out anywhere, there's knight f6. Maybe queen f3, knight f6. Queen d3. I'm trying to go there. There might be rook h6 defending everything. That's unbelievable if this actually works. Yeah, but I guess it I guess it must work. All right, I'm going to I'm not going to sacrifice everything yet. I've never seen this move in my life. <laughs> but it's a bot, you know. Okay, now it can't move the e pawn. So, I I'm always looking at h4 as well. It's another possibility. But let's just put the rook on the open file. I mean, this is just improving the position. 101. Oh god, Gotham bot just gave away a pawn. Gotham bot just played e6, which is a move that is not possible. Um, that's bad. If that's actually possible, I might be in trouble. But um, it, I, I guess the idea is knight c5. So, okay. Uh, what do we play here? c4 or c3? Let's play c3. Solid. Maybe load up a cannon. I can sack. Also have h4. h4, knight e5. Take, take, looks pretty good to me. Let's play h4. Let's try to open up that king. Oh, you have a threat. Yes, I do. Uh-oh. <laughs> Gotham bot is mad. Take, take, the h file's opening. Now I'm going for it. I mean, we're, this, we're in this deep. Let's go for it. Oh, Lord, this is terrifying. Knight takes g5, targeting the pawn on e6. My king's going to f1. All right, now Gotham bot is going to try to play queen h5. I got to be ready. I don't want to trade the queens. So what do I do? Uh, what do I do? I can play knight. Oh, man. Bishop e2. The bot is going to go queen g6. I can play g3 to try to block. But then, then I'm going to have to trade queens, which I'm, I'm not a fan of. I don't want to trade the queens. Queen f3, queen h5. Maybe f4? F4, bishop, back to E2. Ch I mean, that look, just looks insane. That looks deranged. Why would anybody play chess like that? I could just come back. Oh, guys, I'm scared. <laughs> guys, I'm scared. I'm playing knight E4. I don't know. I don't know. I'm playing knight E4. I'm going to try to get my rook into the attack. I'm going to play rook E4 and put my rook right there. Okay. Rook G4 check. What's the idea? Oh, the king's running. Queen f3. The king's running. The king's running back to the home. <laughs> this is crazy. So g3 now. Or king f1. Like, I'm mated. Queen h1 is mate. So I gotta... I don't, do I have a tactic? Do I have, like, a bishop move? g3, rook g8. Am I cooked? Am I cooked? Will I have to trade the queens? That would be so sad. Do, is there just... Oh, is there E5? Oh, no! No! Is there queen F6? Oh, then I get made it. <laughs> no! Oh, I got too arrogant. But it's my bot. He's terrible. He just lost the game up a whole piece. 
What if I just continue the- Oh, I can't even take. Oh, I can't even take. All right. I'm gonna resign. But, but it's not over because I played a stupid opening on purpose. Alien Gambit is not good when you're playing against the bot. What about, is G5 one of the best moves, by the way? It's not. But it's one of the setups. And yeah, I just got, okay. So I'm gonna play the Karo Khan again against Mr. Uh, Gotham Bot. And this time I'm gonna play what I really wanted to play. I'm gonna play the fantasy. I'm gonna see if I can beat my own bot in the fantasy variation. If I had one game against the Carl Khan, I would probably play the fantasy. All right, here we go. Knight F3, playing the mainline fantasy. That is, uh, that is one of the moves. I'm gonna play the setup with pawn to C3 and the bishop here. What is that? What? Did I blunder? Is this like a gambit? What? But don't I get like a huge... What, what is going on? Knight f6? What about e5? Uh... Am I stupid? The knight can't move anywhere. If queen e7, I can take the... Boys and girls, I can't tell what's happening in this what what i also feel like i can castle i just get like a huge attack but now i just take back and i'm defending right queen before i have knight b2 knight d2 wait this is just crushing for white how do i only know one opening but my bot doesn't know the opening well, I guess the idea is castles here take queen c5 check, king h1, and then it takes my, which kind of makes sense, which, which, which kind of makes sense. Um, but wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Castles, knight e5. Also, I don't have to castle. I can play knight c3 or bishop f4. So what if I just play knight c3? Where's the bot moving? Like, I just have massive development. Holy crap, it's sacked a piece. What? What? <laughs> it's just down a piece. What is my bot? Oh! <laughs> oh, it got me. <laughs> so watch yourself. Oh my God, the bot is out for revenge. Oh, this is really bad. Oh, this is embarrassing. I, I did not even... Oh, I did not even... God, playing, playing and, and streaming and, and talking out loud is so difficult. I did not even see that. I mean, that is embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Of course I should play like... Oh, good lord. Okay. Oh, my. But I know it's my bot. So it's probably going to do something stupid. But now I can't castle. Now I'm behind in development. Now I can't castle. That's bad. All right. That's bad. It's time for a comeback. All right, it's time for a comeback. The bot is gonna develop and then it's gonna try to castle. What do I want? Do I wanna keep trying to attack? Do I wanna keep trying to create threats? What do I want? Let's go here. I'm thinking B3. Then it's gonna probably gonna go back to E6. Uh, yeah, I'm in a little trouble. I can't, I can't lie. I don't see... I don't see the way forward. Losing that pawn was not intelligent by me. Maybe I can sacrifice the pawn and put pressure on the file. But... Seems... Aggressive. Maybe... Again, black is going to consolidate very quickly. So I need to do something... Wow. I need to do something a little bit... Not so spicy and probably just slow play the position build up an attack a little bit at a time let's go here i'm gambiting this pawn i want it to be taken oh look at my bot smarter than me 
Long Castle. Still gambiting the spawn. Okay. Now I think I'm gonna cook. Now I think I'm gonna be in good shape. Uh, don't exactly know why, or how, or what the plan is. But I feel like with the opening of this position, I should be pretty happy. Queen f5 looks really good. If knight g6, I take. Queen f5 looks really good. Wait a minute. That's just crushing, no? Yeah, now I go right here. Black can't castle. Or do I play king b1? No, I can't play king b1 because then black castles. Stupid. Maybe check first. Um, this looks pretty good for me. I mean, black can't castle now. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this looks pretty good. I like what we got going on here. King b1, rook d6. I can, uh, I can take, and black can't castle, period, because the king moved. At which point, maybe then I'll play king b1. But then the king might walk over. Maybe now I'll play king b1. Check. Yeah, let's play king b1 now. Ooh, this looks bad. Now's my moment. Now's my moment. How am I going to get a winning position right now? Now is my moment. I have to seize the moment. If I take, take a3. Queen can't go to d6 because of rook d1. Queen can't go to c5 because of b4. Oh, that looks really good. I think this is my moment. I don't want to get tunnel vision, but I think I'm about to cook my bot. And I'm about to put to... I think this is the move. I think this is the move. If queen g4, I take the knight. Wait, what? It's loot. What? What? It's losing. I just take the queen. I'm, I'm going to win a piece. I don't even have to take the queen. I can back up and take the knight and keep my queen on the board. Oh, Lord. Oh, my gosh. I'm completely winning. I'm completely winning. Oh, I'm so scared. Queen e2. This is crazy. Queen e2. King c7. Rook d3. It's over. I just win. I'm winning. It's over. Oh my god. I'm completely winning. The fantasy is OP! Oh, this is nuts. I just go b4, no? I just go b4. It's gonna go queen f5. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Scumbag bot. Maybe king a2 first. Set up the threat. Maybe give a check. Maybe give a check. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give a check. So now the bot can't go queen f5. And now I'm going b4 in the next move. I'm going b4. It's gonna give me a check. I'm gonna play rook d1. It can't stop me. I'm completely winning. I'm completely winning. It's over. B4. It can't guard. It can't. It's going to lose this bishop. It's over. It's completely panicking. I completely didn't see that move, but that's fine. That's fine. I'm still winning. I'm still winning. I can send this to an endgame if I want. Should I? Or should I keep my queen on the board? Queen F7. Or Queen D7. No, Queen D7's bad. Still winning, but... Queen D7. Rook D8. I can play take, take... Take, king c7, knight d5, discovered check, and then I can try to win that endgame. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm spoiled for choice. Or do I just try to win the endgame with the... I'm, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to put my rook right here. I said, I don't need my queen anymore. That's what, that's, what, that's what I just said. And now I can just play knight to e4. And I don't know how it's going to protect that pawn. It's not going to protect that pawn. Music to my ears. Now I'm just going to be a full piece up. I can also play knight d6. Let me just take this. I am just up a full knight. All right, it got that. Whatever. I don't care. Oh, boy. Now, I am a pretty decent defender, but... Let's try to convert this position as seamlessly as possible. Um, knight d6 will send us to an endgame... Cleanly up a bishop. There we go. We are just up a bishop. This should be a walk in the park. Uh, h4, or we start bringing our king. Let's bring up our king. It's very important to bring the king up in the endgame. Check. I come back and block. I do this. I don't have to play this dance, but... 
Uh, bishop d4, targeting the pawn. Don't want to let all the pawns start coming up the board, so I should be a little bit careful. But, uh, yeah, now we can just play h4. We're now two squares closer to promotion. Two squares. Did I say two, two quit? What even is a quare? Squares. And now we're going to just try to win this endgame, and by try, I mean absolutely succeed, because it is hopeless for black. Rook e3, trading the rooks. It's going to go here. Uh... Can I trap the rook, by the way? I kind of want to trap the rook. Rook e5, and it's over. Uh-oh! I should protect this. Yeah, I don't know why I'm trying to make this more exciting, but I guess that's just my playing style. All right. Now it's easy. Now we... Can give a check. I still need to be precise though, because those pawns are coming. So let's play rook all the way down, push this pawn to h6. Push the pawn, defend it by the bishop. Uh, let's take. So the pawn is on h6, it's got good support. And uh, now we will just target these pawns. Like this. Uh, rook a8. I think it's over. Rook a7. a4. h7. a3. Uh-oh. Can I run my king out of this little territory? Maybe that's the plan. Maybe that's the move. That would be insane if I screwed this up. That would be completely crazy. That'd be nuts. What, what am I doing? Rook here, a4. Maybe I can give a check. Let's just run the king. I just need it. I just need this. That's all I need. I just need the escort of the... Targeting my bishop. Do I depart the diagonal? I guess I do. I mean, I don't... I just need to promote. I just need to promote. That's all I need. Just let me queen, bro. Check. Go to the A file. Good, 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 good. It's good progress. Good progress. Uh, let's come back. And rook b7. Easy. Come back and rook b7. Rook b7. And that's it. We're gonna win. That's it. That's it. You can't stop me now. Um, in here. Bishop d4. I'm too fast. I should not have done that. Why did I do that? Now I have to reposition my bishop again. Just... I'm so dumb! <laughs> what am I doing? Alright, there we go. We're winning. Ah, uh, now it's gonna check me a lot, but it's not good enough, and I'm gonna win. Oh, stressful. I'm gonna make another rook. No, I'm not. I'm gonna make a queen. <laughs> yes! Yes! You suck! You suck, and if I don't play a meme opening, I'm going to win every single time, bro. You can't stop me. AI has been defeated today. King C3, it's over. Yeah. This is my AI beating song. I defeated my AI. Takes. Put the bishop on the other side. And let's pre-move a checkmate. I don't know how it's going to move, so... Let's go. Build a box. You don't even need the bishop. There it is. Box technique. There it is. Boom. Boom. Build a box. Boom. Now here I can waste the move. And all the way back. And I have slain the Gotham bot.